Now we will take a look at configuring your information bar and information panel in SiteWorks. So let's identify these two items. First we have the information bar which is located at the top of your screen and then in the bottom left panel we have the information panel which we've selected to be displayed in that panel. So let's go to the settings and configure these two items. Let's go to the main menu and from there we will select settings and in the list of items to choose from we will go to info bar slash panel and select it. Here you can see in this window that there are two options, your information panel and information bar. Inside the information bar you have a list of items that can be displayed in this section along with the location of which you see it on the screen, top, bottom, or it can be hidden. We're going to keep it at the top. Next you can see that there's a whole list of items that you can choose from and check boxes beside them. So let's take a look at these lists. You have a whole long list of different items to choose from. So depending on what you want to see, all you have to do is select these items by checking the boxes. Now the way they are shown in this list is the order that they will be displayed on the information bar. So if you would like to move these items then we can move them by holding down on this double line and moving it down to where you want it to be. Now you can see that you can move these items. Now our northing is before our easting. Cut and fill, design elevation. That's how you move the items so that you can display them in the order you choose on the information bar. So we will select design elevation, northing, easting, cut and fill, and our current elevation. Hit accept. Now you see that our information is displayed right here. Okay, so now let's take a look at the information panel, which we see in this section. Go back to our main menu, go back to settings, and go back to information bar and panel. Now, up here, let's select the tab information panel. As you can see that there's the same items that are selected here which you can use in the information panel. The same principle applies for moving these items in the order you want them to and then selecting them by checking the boxes of which items you want displayed within the panel. Antenna and target height, cut and fill, design elevation. We'll move easting down here, northing easting current elevation. Hit accept and now you see right here your information is displayed. That is how you configure your information bar and information panel within SiteWorks. Like this video? Give it a thumbs up. For more content like this, click subscribe for instant access to updates and new videos. Also, check the description for links to additional support files and content. And as always, thanks for watching.